Hello to you. This is Edwin Dearborn with another edition of Caffeinated Content. And today, I'm talking about the great business ideas over a hot cup of coffee. And today, I'm going to talk about how to repurpose your Facebook live content. I'm here at Panera Bread, which has got pretty good coffee. Uh, got great cinnamon rolls, but <clears throat> you probably know this. I'm on a 30-day weight loss challenge, so I'm not having any cinnamon rolls or muffins. No carbs. I am strictly on protein, veggies, and a lot of water and a lot of exercise, but I diverge. Today, I'm here to talk about how to repurpose your Facebook Live content. What I'm doing right now with this edition of Caffeinated Content is I'm creating content. This is a live video going out to uh, all the people that follow me here on Facebook. But did you know that you can actually take your Facebook Live content and you can use it in other places? That, that's what I mean by repurposing. We're gonna take the content and we're gonna put it in other locations on other platforms to be used and found in those places. So the first way that you can repurpose your Facebook Live videos is that you upload them from Facebook to your computer as an MP file. You're going to download that video into your MP file and then once you have it in your file you can take that video and you can now upload it to YouTube which is a completely different platform. Now you may not know this but YouTube is owned by Google so if you optimize your YouTube video correctly for whatever keyword you're trying to rank it for you can actually get it to uh, be found in local Google search or Google search and there you go you can actually have that as another piece of content and from YouTube you can actually share it to social media you can share it to Twitter LinkedIn stumble upon tumblr uh, Twitter you can retweet it multiple times so now you have that video that you don't have to create twice that is now got a lot of leverage and you can use elsewhere Okay, so that's the first way that you can repurpose your Facebook Live video is upload it to YouTube, optimize it for keywords, local keywords, broad keywords, however you want to search for it, okay? Then point number two, I'm doing a Facebook Live. I'm on Facebook. We want to make you happy. Oh, I, that's not going to happen. <laughs> they, so, some, some people walked up and said they wanted to make me nervous, and I said, that's not going to happen. <laughs> So, anyways, um, <clears throat> um, <laughs> everybody's getting entertained that I'm on Facebook Live here. So, so now we upload it to uh, YouTube. We optimize it for local search. And number two, um, I can take that YouTube video and I can actually now put it in a blog, right? So, if you have a blog, you can take that file from YouTube and you can upload it to your blog. You can have the YouTube video transcribed at rev.com for a dollar a minute and now you have a blog post. So now, A, I have the original content of the Facebook Live. Two, I've uploaded it to YouTube, which I can share to multiple social media platforms as well as have it found in Google search for my keywords. Number three, <clears throat> I can turn that into a blog post not only just the video in the blog, but I can transcribe the blog and have all those words in that blog post. Number three, the repurposing, is I can take that video and that written content that I put in my blog and I can put it across multiple blog channels such as medium.com, LinkedIn Pulse, which has got a blog platform. I can put it into Quora.com and all of these other blog platforms like Medium, Quora, LinkedIn, and, and there's others, uh, Blogger, is I can actually put all that content in there and have it found within their ecosystem. So if somebody's in LinkedIn and they are looking for uh, articles about whatever you talked about, they can find your content within that ecosystem. Same with Quora, same with Medium, right? And you've got content optimized across multiple platforms, which may be found in one platform, but not another. 
So what you're doing is you're cross-pollinating your content across multiple platforms, giving you more opportunities. Now, here's the SEO value of all this repurposing this content. When I put it in medium.com, I can embed links in medium.com, quora.com, LinkedIn Pulse, Blogger, YouTube. I'm building links from this repurposed content back to my original blog or my landing page or my website or whatever I'm trying to get uh, SEO link juice for. So I can take this one video, I'm gonna upload it, I'm gonna call it how to repurpose Facebook content, right? Have it transcribed, turn it into a blog post, and in every one of those blogs on Blogger, LinkedIn, Quora, etc., I'm gonna put a link to my website. See, so I'm not only building SEO value, I'm also building opportunities that if they find me on YouTube or LinkedIn or Blogger or, 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 that they're gonna link back to my website, thus I am proactively driving traffic and audience and potential customers back to my main website. So, this is a very, very simple strategy that you can replicate. Now, the question is, well, what should I do Facebook Live events about? And that's gonna be my next subject of caffeinated content. What should I, t I be talking about on Facebook Live? Because I've been coaching quite a few realtors, mortgage brokers, doctors, um, investment guys, annuity people as clients, and I tell them about, you know, you should be putting content on Facebook Live, and the first question is, well, what, should, what content should I be putting on Facebook Live? What, 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 what do I talk about, right? And that's a great question. And I'm gonna show you not only what to talk about, but how to storyboard what to talk about. So it's not just, you've got ideas that are a one-off, and you're like, oh, what do I talk about now? And you're always having to come up with bright ideas. It's better if you have a strategic position with your content and you actually have a content strategy. Okay, so I hope this was helpful. How to repurpose your Facebook Live videos. Again, YouTube, number one. Number two, upload it to your blog. And then number three, cross-pollinate that same blog post across other uh, independent blog channels such as medium.com, Quora, LinkedIn, Pulse, etc. Okay, I hope you found this of value. I'm Edwin Dearborn, author of Power Branding Secrets, where I show businesses how to expand in our digital age. See you later.